I'll try and remember to turn my microphone on this time. Oh, I can hear you. Good. <laughs> Here we are, just turn that away. Uh, Anna tuned me out. There we are. Happens all the time. We've been married a long time. Uh, very happily, I have to say. Um, just to wrap up very quickly, this is a this is a tip that um, if you don't have the currency matrix, this is a if you like a a manual way of doing it. Um, what I've got set up here are basically um, I haven't got seven, but I've got six of the majors. So it's if you like, it's a it's a majors matrix. Uh, I've got the pound, Aussie, Euro, dollar, CAD, New Zealand dollar, dollar Swiss down here, and it's just a neat way of seeing what is going on in terms of risk sentiment, not in terms of risk sentiment, but certainly in terms of sentiment across the particular complex. And you can do this for any any particular group. I just happen to do on the majors, but you could do a yen complex, you do a euro complex, New Zealand complex, whatever. And you then get a sense of what is going on. In this particular case, obviously, you get a very much a strong sense of what's going on in the dollar. Is the market universally buying dollar? Is it selling dollar? What is it doing at the moment? It's pretty much in congestion. You can see this is on one minute. Uh, I can change this up to maybe go a little bit slow. Let's move this up to the five minute. There we go. Uh, just refresh that up. Let's uh, put these on here. There we go. Put that one on there. There we go. Right, okay. Um, so basically, it's it's a neat way of seeing, um, first of all, the sentiment towards a particular currency across the matrix. So in particular, the dollar here. What it also gives you is particularly where you've got inverse relationships, you've got the classical one of dollar, Swiss, euro, dollar, obviously, um, although, you know, that hasn't been holding that strongly, although it's still very much in place, as you can see there, uh, you know, as euro dollars falling, dollar, Swiss is rising. It has been, it hasn't broken down, but it's been in and out a little bit, so it hasn't been as strong as it used to correlate, but it's, it's pretty close. Uh, what you also get from that is that Particularly if you're trading euro dollar, for example, it gives you an inverse perspective from volume price analysis perspective. So if you're trading euro dollar and you've got the dollar Swiss up, it just gives you a different view, an upside down view, if you will, of what is going on in terms of euro dollar. And the same is true when you're looking across the other charts. If you're trading cable or you're trading Aussie, you look and see what's going on in terms of cable. Obviously, you, you don't expect to see the same sort of price action, identical price action, but you often see similar uh, phases of price action. You'll see similar levels coming into play. You'll see things like volatility triggers, which happen across all, all the various pairs at the same time. So you get a much more balanced picture of what is going on across the complex from the perspective of just trading one chart in isolation. Too many Forex traders just trade one chart, they'll look at a Euro dollar chart, they'll be fixated on that, won't have a clue what's going on across the complex, and just happily trade that in isolation of everything else, irrespective of relational analysis. You know, goodness, goodness knows, you know, what that is. I don't want to know about that. I'm just on my Euro dollar chart. Well, at least this opens your, your your span, if you will, a little bit and gives you some idea of what is going on across the complex. If you're trading euro dollar, you want to know what's going on in the euro complex and you want to know what's going on in the dollar complex. And this gives you a different way of looking at it. And it also embraces a different view of volume price analysis across the various currency pairs. And particularly if you're trading euro dollar, the inverse obviously on dollar Swiss will give you an upside down view as well. So it's just a nice way of, of it's a it's a little tip, if you like, for using, you know, if you're trading currencies, create one of these. If you don't have the currency matrix, this will give you a similar sort of perspective on, on that, on what the currency matrix does. I'm going to wrap up there because we've gone way over time. Apologies for that. Uh, just pop this up. Um, this is the Forex Trading Program. I know we have some students with us at the moment, so very, a very warm welcome to you. Um, it is the complete Forex Trading Program because that's precisely what it does. Uh, it gives you everything you need to know, all the tools, all the information, all the knowledge, all the skills to succeed as in, in trading Forex. Whether you want to trade it as a separate income and an additional income, whether ultimately you want to quit your job and trade full time, we don't suggest you do that from the off because you need the uh, you need the knowledge and tools and experience to build over time. You you cannot just jump into this aspect to make money and and live off it, you know, from day one. It takes time and it takes effort. If you're prepared to put the effort into this, it will reap the rewards, but it does take effort. We have a lot of successful students, but I guarantee you the ones who succeed are the ones who are prepared to put the effort in. It's as simple as that. I'm not going to wrap it up and, and coat it in sugar. It does take effort, but if you want to put the effort in, you know, this is all there for you. It's a huge array. We cover fundamentals, relational, technical, the mechanics of trading. 
and then there's over 200 hours of video down here there's 13 pdf downloads you know the information is here anna and i are in the vpa chat room down here all the all the time every day so if you've got questions you're in a friendly group there's students there as well it's a very friendly environment and we're there to help and support you because at the end of the day we just want you to succeed that's our goal in life nothing else it's just to get you to succeed Whatever it is you want in your life, whether as I say, you just want it as an additional income or actually ultimately you want to be able to quit your job and do this full time working from home. In terms of the indicators, you can find them all here. MT45, NinjaTrader 78, TradingView, uh, TradeStation we're literally working on. We've got the, we're building the domain. We've got the, uh, all the support pages going in. All the enablement systems being built. The indicators have been tested. We're going to roll those out on 9.5, which is uh, the TradeStation global offering, which is the relationship between interactive brokers and TradeStation. If you have an IP account, it's a fantastic way to go. You just bolt it onto TradeStation. You can trade through TradeStation. It's fantastic. So we'll be launching that, the indicators for that. And then we've got TradeStation 10, which is TradeStation Securities, which has radar screen and all the other bills and whistles. Very, very powerful platform. Wonderful stuff. Once we've launched those, which is probably going to be in the next sort of two or three weeks now, uh, then we're going to drop back on Trading View because we've got object and line drawing available now. We can pretty much uh, be assured we can port all the other indicators over onto Trading View. So if you've got some of them on Trading View already, you'll have access to all the others that are on MT45 and NinjaTrader and, of course, TradeStation. After that, once we've uh, once we've tidied up TradingView, we'll be probably more moving on to multi charts as the next platform to attack, and we've got a couple more in the pipeline as well. You can catch up with Anna here, AnnaCooling.com. You can find all the books here; they're all up on Amazon. All the hundreds of wonderful reviews from from you know delighted traders who are who've you know revolutionised their trading. You can read them for yourself. They're wonderful. They're very humbling, and very heartwarming. Um, so you can find those there. They're in Kindle or they're in paperback as well both versions and all the other uh, links to the various sites here from Anna's site too. Uh, so that's it. I'm done. I really appreciate you coming along today. Apologies for the gap in the middle on sound. That was entirely my fault. Nothing at your end. So I'm sorry about that. Hope you've enjoyed it. Hope you found something useful and you've learned something and perhaps learned something you didn't know before you came along today. Uh, we will be back next week on Tuesday morning, London time, 7.45 UK time for the London Open. So we will see you there. If you have any questions, you can drop them to me, David at quantumtrading.com or Anna, Anna at annacooling.com. Happy to answer them there. Thanks for coming along today and enjoy the rest of the trading session. We will see you soon. Have a great weekend and we will see you next week. Bye for now.